Hey guys, this is Jordan with Rocky Mountain ATV MC and this is our Cruiser Pants Buyer's Guide. When it comes to cruiser pants, there are so many things that goes into them. You want them to look and feel and perform, especially like the pants that you currently have in your closet, and that's some of the things that we are going to be going over today. Now, what sets these pants apart from the pants that you get from regular department stores is going to be a protection standpoint, the extra padding that goes into them, like the reinforcement, the stitching. There's so many things that we're going to talk about and why you should get these versus just regular pants for riding. So, sit back and relax, and let's get started. All right, first up on the list, this is going to be the Scorpion Covert Pants. Now, on my right, this is Josh. He's 190 pounds and he has six foot two inches. He is wearing a size 34. The pants are 34 as well, so they do fit true to size. One thing I do want to note about the sizing, these, in, like these pants have an inseam of 32. Whether you go up in waist or down in waist, they're still going to be the same at 32 inches for the inseam. Getting into the cut and material of the Scorpion Covert Pant, this is going to be a straight leg all the way down and the material itself is going to be a heavy duty denim at 14 ounces. Now, um, a standout for this pant is from the knee all the way up to the waist and around is going to be Kevlar. Now it's a DuPont Kevlar at 165 GSM, which stands for grams per square meter, which is a nice tight woven to help you with those road rashes if you do go down. Can you turn around for me, Josh? Now on the back of the pant, we don't have a lot of bling here. It's really muted out. You, you, have, you have the classic Scorpion logo up here at the waistline and also on the pocket. And then as we talked about a little bit before, the Kevlar goes from, from the back of the knee all the way up to protect you as well. Can you turn around for me, Josh? Okay, so price point on these bad boys, we're looking at sub $120. Colorways that you're gonna get is a black stone wash and a blue stone wash this is what we currently have here. And that is gonna do it. This is the Covert Motorcycle Pants from Scorpion. Next up on the list, this is the Speed and Strength Dog of War Textile Pants. To my right, this is Zach. He is 200 pounds and he is 5'8 and he wears 36. What he's currently wearing right now is a size 36 from Speed and Strength and as you can see, they do fit true to size. Now, getting into the construction of the pants themselves, this is going to be a cotton poly blend, which is very comfortable, it's very soft, and you have a lot of strength and durability with the pants. Moving on down to the leg and over at the knee, there's a whole bunch going on here and let's point it out. So we've got some CE rated protection right here. Right behind that is gonna be some two DuPont Kevlar. And then above that, we have a stretch panel right here above the knee for actuation. The pants themselves are going to be a straight leg all the way down. So Zach, can you move and turn around on the back for me? So now as we were talking about that um, six pocket design, right above the back two pockets here that have a snap to keep those things closed, there is going to be a stretch paneling right here for when you're actually sitting on the motorcycle. Now to go along with that stretch paneling, each loop is going to be a double loop all the way around to make sure that we're holding up your pants. All right, Zach, can you turn around for the front for me? Now on the overall, Speed and Strength did a really good job with this pant. We really like the styling. I really like it. It really has a new age look to it for some of the younger riders that are out there. Now, Zach, uh, Zach here is wearing a 32 inseam. And what I like what Speed and Strength did is with each of the sizes, they offer a tall for each of the pants, which is really good for us tall guys out there because I'm 6'4". Now, price of these bad boys, we're looking at sub $150. Colorways that you're going to get is olive and black, which is what we are currently featuring right here. Now, let, let's talk about fit guarantee. So let's say that the size just doesn't fit for you, it doesn't fit right, maybe it's a little bit too big, maybe it's a little bit too small. We're gonna get you taken care of. We're gonna take care of the shipping on both the ways there and back on, on the first exchange so you don't have to worry about it so we can make sure that you get the right size. Well guys, that's gonna do it. This is the Speed and Strength Dog of War Textile Pant. All right guys, next up on the list, this is Alpine Stars Copper Motorcycle Jeans. Now, up here on the stand, this is Seth. He is 6'3", 220 pounds, and he typically wears a size 34. What he is currently wearing is a 36. Now, if you're in between sizes, we actually recommend going up because these jeans tend to run just a little bit small around the waist. Now, looking at the construction of the jean itself, it is going to be a 13 ounce heavy denim. And what that does for you is it helps out with abrasion and also tear resistance for the jean. Moving on down to the knee, we've got CE certified knee protectors. They're also removable and the pocket itself that they sit in, very nice touch from Alpine Stars, 
has some adjustment to it depending on how tall or how short you are. Really like that they did that. Now the material that sits right behind that, that is going to be the aromatic fiber reinforcement panel for extra protection. Moving on up the leg, you will have some additional hip protection. It's not going to be CE certified, but they are going to have some adjustment to it and they are removable as well. Seth, will you face the back for me, please? Now the pockets on these bad boys, you're going to get a traditional five pocket design. Pretty typical, it's classic. I really like the way this, these pants look. There's no bling to them. It's really muted out. It's really nice. It's, it has a nice chic to it. Now also, like the actual fit of these pants is going to be a straight leg fit. So it's not going to be a skinny or like a bell bottom or a boot cut. It is a straight leg fit. Now in the seat, which comes midway up the thigh, you will have the aromatic fiber reinforcement paneling for that extra protection that you need. Seth, can you turn back to the front for me, please? All right, so on the whole, we really like these jeans. We really like how they look. We really like how they feel. They, they are a very comfortable jean. Price point of these bad boys is gonna be upwards in the $200 range, and colorways that you're gonna get is gonna be black, the raw that we're currently featuring right here, and then also the dark wash, which is going to be a regular style blue jean. Well guys, that's gonna do it. This is the Alpine Star Copper Motorcycle Jeans. Okay, next up on the table and fourth on the list, this is going to be Dainese's Bonneville Jeans. Now, we have got Seth here on my right. He is 6'3", 220 pounds. He typically wears a size 34. We had to put him in a 36 because these jeans run a little small. They are a little tight around the waist. So something to consider when you're using the sizing chart. Now, as for the denim itself, it's going to be a stone wash denim, so it's going to be nice and soft, and I like that Dainese did that, so you can keep that nice, comfortable feel. Now, moving on down to the knee, it is going to be a DuPont Kevlar fiber to protect your knees, and also on the side of the hips and in the seat, which we'll have him turn around in a few minutes to take a look at that as well. Now, moving on down to the knee here, we've got Dainese's pre-shaped Pro Armor knee protectors. They have a hexagonal print to them, so they have a lot of breathability, so you won't have those sweat patches when you're riding. Moving on up to the hip, now you have the same type of hip pad. It's not gonna be in this pan. It doesn't come with this pan, but you can buy it separately on our website. Seth, I'm gonna have you turn around and face the back for me, please. Now, as we turn around and Face the back, you, you will also have the back reinforcement for the DuPont Kevlar in the seat from the midway up the hip, or the midway up the thigh, all the way up to the top there. You have, you have the nice classic patch there from Dainese. And then the pocket itself, if you notice, it's gonna be a little bit different. It's not gonna be up top, it's gonna be halfway down. All right, Seth, will you turn around to the front for me, please? Okay, so if you've noticed, it's gonna be a four pocket design versus the traditional five pocket that we've seen here on the table. We're, we're missing the pocket right here for something small like a key. Moving on down, the pant leg itself is going to be a regular fit versus a skinny or a boot cut, or maybe even like a loose or baggy feel. Down at the bottom, there's some reflectivity at the cuff. Now, whether you choose to keep that folded up or keep it down, it's up to you. It's a nice safety feature that Dainese has added to these pants. Colorways that you're gonna get for the Dainese Bonneville pant is going to be a medium one is what we're currently featuring here. There is also a dark wash as well, which will just be just a little bit darker than we, what we've currently got now. Price point is gonna be just north of $200, and that's gonna do it. This is the Dainese Bonneville Motorcycle Riding Jeans. All right, guys, last up on the list, and definitely not least when it comes to some of our favorites here at Rocky Mountain ATV MC, this is the Revit Philly Motorcycle Jeans. Now to my right here, we've got Brandon. He's 230 pounds and he is 6'3". He typically wears a 38. However, we've got him in 36s. Now if you're in between sizes like Brandon is, we always recommend going a size down so we have a nice, secure fit and feel in case you do go down so the pant will be able to perform as it's intended to. Now for the denim of the jean, it is going to be 12.5 ounces of Cordura, which is a strong denim and also soft as well. Now for the stitching of the pants, like they have safety stitching for the inseam, you will have a, strip, a triple stitching for the outside and in the seat of the pant. And then you will also have a double layer of power shield which backs up the denim. So it can keep you protected in case you do go down. All right, Brandon, can you turn and face the back for me, please? Now for the 
for the pad itself and on the inside, which is something that you can't see, is going to be a poly cotton blend or poly cotton twill, which is going to be 50% cotton and 50% polyester, which is really nice. It's very comfortable and it feels really nice against your skin. Now in the seat area from, from halfway up the thigh all the way up to the top here, it's going to be an extra layer for those longer rides for a more comfortable fit. Now as for the jean itself, it's going to be a loose cut or a loose fit versus a skinny, straight, or even a baggy fill, or even a bell bottom, or so it's gonna be a nice loose fit, is, is how the cut is done. Uh, as you can see, there's the triple stitching here, there's a triple stitching on the side as well. All right, Brandon, can you turn around and face forward for me, please? Okay, so looking at the loops themselves, we've got two right here, we've got two more in the back, and then we've got two on the sides that, that are gonna be angled in like this for when you're seated in the motorcycle so it doesn't actuate with your belt. And then looking at the pocket design itself, we have five pockets, and then you, you will have the uh, smaller pocket here for a key or something small. Moving on down to the knee itself, you have the C-Smart CE rated protection pads right there. And you can get them at the hip as well, but it is not, uh, they do not come with this pant and you'll have to buy them separately. Moving on down to the ankle, this is where you have the 3M Scotch Light reflectivity, which is really nice and we like the fact that uh, Revit added in that extra safety feature. Now if you want to choose to roll them how we've got them rolling them so you can see them, that's up to you, or you can keep them rolled down, it's definitely going to be a preference. Now when it comes to price point, we're looking at sub $250. And colorways you'll get, you'll get a, a medium wash, a dark wash, which is what we're currently featuring here, and then a dark gray as well. All in all, we feel that Revit did a great job with this pant. There's so many things that are going on from a comfort standpoint, to safety, to protection, even some nice styling as well. That's gonna do it. These, this is the Revit Philly 2 Motorcycle Jeans. Keep in mind, we have a huge selection of cruiser pants on our website, so go check that out. Guys, we want to know what you guys are currently wearing. We want to know what you guys are currently using, what the application that you guys are currently using them for. Let's get this conversation started. Now remember, Rocky Mountain ATV MC has the largest selection of motorcycle apparel and parts ready to ship today and in stock. If it's a little bit too big, if it's a little bit too small, that's where we have our fit guarantee that we talked about a little bit earlier. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to give us a ring and our tech support will be able to answer that for you. If you haven't already, click the like button below and subscribe to our YouTube channel so you're not missing out on a thing. Thanks for watching. This is Jordan with Rocky Mountain ATVMC and we'll see you on the streets.